So object has recently changed their profile verification process. So the last video in which we verify through the TZKT Explorer is no longer applicable. And now you have to use Tezos profiles to verify your profile on object. Keep in mind that the old video is still valid for TZKT profile. So if you want your TZKT Explorer profile to look something like this, you still need to do the old process. And the new process is based on TZ profiles, which will look something like this in the end. And it is what object uses now. So let's see how you can set up one. A big shout out to Kablin for providing a step by step tweet showing how you can update your profile. When you log into your account, tap on your profile and click on profile. You're seeing this profile picture because I updated it last time using the TZKT Explorer so the image is still there but there is no info here so to add that click on this edit profile button it will take you to the TZ profiles website so click on connect wallet and select mainnet select connect wallet choose your wallet I'm using temple so I'll click on temple To confirm the transaction, click on connect. And now you will see you have a lot of options to verify and complete your profile. So first click on basic profile information. So this is a self attested form. So whatever you enter will be added to your Tezos profile. So make sure to enter these correctly. So just add whatever username you'd like, add some description and add a website if you have one. If you don't, I think you can use a social media handle or link as well. So for the logo image, you, you actually don't need to upload it, but you need to use some image which is already available on the web. So if you have a website, you can use an image from your own website. But the quickest method to do this would be to go to your Twitter. Open your profile and I'm on my profile. Click on my profile picture, right click and copy image address. Don't copy image, copy image address. So if we open an incognito tab and paste the link, you'll see that it opens up the image. So I'll go back to the TZ profiles, enter the URL right here. Click on submit. So now click review and sign. Click on sign and it's awaiting upload. Next step is your Twitter verification. This is not compulsory but if you want you can skip this step also. So just click on verify and enter your Twitter handle. So I'll add mine and click on submit. Click on signature prompt and click on sign. Next, there's a message you need to tweet. It's already written here. You just need to click on tweet. So it will take you to the Twitter and click on tweet. Then view your tweet and copy the URL of the tweet. So when you open this tweet, Right click and copy the URL. Click on done and then verify your tweet. So we copied that URL. You need to paste it here. So paste it here and verify tweet. So it's done and click on return to profile. So both are awaiting upload right now. So the next step is to deploy your profile. So click on deploy profile and agree to the terms and service and click on deploy. This will open up your temple wallet and you need to sign this.
Next you will see that you will have to pay some gas fees. It is around 0.3 Tezos. Confirm the transaction. And it just updated to profile deployed. So let's return to profile and you will see that this is complete and this is complete. So if we go back to object, I think it will not update right now. But as soon as it is updated, I'll add it in the video. So if you want to confirm if your profile is updated or not, go back to Tezos profiles, connect your wallet. And now click on search profiles. Now if you click this, your wallet address will be copied automatically. So click on this and paste it here. Now click on find and you will see it will show your profile with all the links that are active. So that is how you set up a TZ profile on object and it will look something like this in the end. Also if you are wondering why it's showing vector reside.tez here instead of my full temple address. I bought a Tezos domain which is pretty straightforward. You can get it from Tezos domains and if you still want a video on that just let me know in the comments and I'll try to create one. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.